Hey guys, I get a lot of questions on, hey, what's the best way to build a script? What's the best script available? I'm gonna give you a couple of small nuggets on how to build a calling script. I don't care if you're calling for PNC, final expense, life, mortgage protection, Medicare, whether you're setting appointments, whether you're teleselling, these are some things that need to be in your script. Number one, you need to gain control. A lot of scripts will say, hey, how are you? Hey, my name is Cody, how are you doing today? When you're asking how you're doing today, number one, you sound like a telemarketer. What telemarketer or call center that calls you doesn't say, how are you doing today? So let's let's X that. So let's not say that. So what we wanna do is, because when you say, hey, how are you doing today? Not only are you sound like a telemarketer, but also you're giving control back to the customer. What we've noticed after thousands of calls, listening to the recordings is, you want to be in control and you don't want to pause. What I've learned a lot is that if you pause, you give the customer, the consumer a chance to say, hey, I'm not interested. Call me back. Uh, my house is on fire. I don't want to talk. Whatever it is, or I'm not interested, it doesn't matter. They are going to insert something to throw you off. You say, hey, I'm from the insurance group. Who, who, who's the insurance group? Where are you at? What's your name again? Like, like they're gonna ask something that is irrelevant, is gonna throw you off. So what we've been doing, whether it's appointment setting, calling, teleselling, doesn't matter, training or training agents, doesn't matter. We are saying, hey, my name's Cody, I'm with this. You recently responded about this. I'm calling because of this. I need your date of birth, please. We're jumping in, we're asking a question because the core parts of a script needs to have you jumping in and saying, hey, to be sure I'm not wasting your time or I'm calling because, the reason I'm calling John is, hey, you responded online. You gave us your favorite hobby, which is to prove that we're not a telemarketer. Even if it doesn't sound scripty, that's okay. Like, hey buddy, to, to let you know that I'm not just a random telemarketer, you put that you like to fish. I wouldn't know that unless you put it in. So that's why I'm calling and to be sure I'm not wasting your time, we're gonna be in your area on Thursday. You requested this information, I need to get it to you. So should we drop it off on, what's normally better, like mornings or afternoons? So it, it gets control, it states, hey, to, to, this is why we're calling, to be sure we're not wasting your time, and then it has an ask, a close, a question. The psychology of sales is if you don't ask a question, they will remain in control. So to, so to make sure that you're in control, you're asking questions, they're answering you, stay in control, quit pausing, quit ask people how they're doing, tell them. Get in control, tell them, assume they're gonna let you get everything out, Assume that when they hear everything, it's gonna make more sense. Assume that they're not gonna say, I'm not interested. And assume that when you get to the end of the script, they're ready to answer your question. These are some small key things that I think about when I think about scripts. So when you build your next script, when you make your next call, think about this, implement these things, and I promise it will help. If you wanna keep seeing all of these videos, make sure, I'm gonna ask one thing. Click subscribe below right now. Please, I love it. I love seeing our subscriber count grow when it grows by the dozens every single day. We're here to help. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you.